you know what? Hit me back. Hit me get hit me back so we get even. Hi guys. Hey, it's Abimala Craig and um keep watching Wacko's review. Prince is annoying. He has tormented me when I'm doing this on the dress, but it is great. Please make sure you like, share, subscribe, and thank you guys for this season of Skin Girl. Grateful. Hey guys, hello people. My name is Heaven Tobule. Yes, Heavens, not Heaven. My name is Heaven Tobule and I play the character AY Ayomidi Balogun in Skin Girl in Transit Season 6. And you all should keep watching. Rolling through. Wako! Hi guys, welcome back to a what? You know what? Wait a minute, I have a video to show you guys. Um, let, let me let me go and get it. Where is it? Where is it? Okay, all right, all right. Watch this video, guys. Hello, Prince from Wacko's Review. This is your girlfriend, Shalima. Well, actually, I don't know if I see a relationship, but I know that me and you had a break because of Kwame, and then now things didn't really work out with me and Kwame. So I'm just thinking, if you're thinking on the same page as me, that me and you, which is me and you, Prince, relationship another try what do you think baby wow did that just happen guys did that just happen did did i just silence my haters did i silence you people please if you are new here i want you to like this video also subscribe and turn on post notifications so you'll be notified when i post and this is also for the people who have been following me since day one or day 2000 you guys should like this video also okay there's nothing else again rolling through So we finally reached the final episode of one of Nigeria's best shows, and that is the Smash Hit. <laughs> nah, I'm talking about Skinny Girl in Transit. And I won't lie, it's sad seeing the characters we have come to love go away. And the question on everyone's mind now is, we they bring this woman back because we need her in the show in the next season. I, I, we need, I'm obsessed with this woman. I'm obsessed and I need it before she blocks me on Instagram. I need to take it easy. <laughs> but let's talk about this episode. For we'll see, she and AY completely redeemed themselves in this episode. But we have always known them as those characters who do not find it hard to mess up. You give this one a car, what does he do? He gets arrested. You give this one material, she makes clothes for idol worshippers. Just, just, just look at that. Eh? But they redeemed themselves by finding the lady that stole Mama Tiwa's money. And now they go back to their daily shenanigans. Shinani, shenanigans. Shinani. But you guys remember, this my channel is a multiple choice channel. And if you don't know what that means, it means you pick the English that fits your ears. I'm going to make constant mistakes. It's your job now <laughs> to keep going. Don't stop for no reason. For me, the funniest scene in the whole season was when Wusi was dancing with Mama Tiwa with that attire that she made. But that wholesome feel did not end there because guess who had to mess it up? Prince now! It's Prince that messed everything up! By making the haters cry after he showed his Charlie baby in the intro. You guys saw it, right? <sighs> Let me sit down back. Should, should I play it again for the guys that did not see it? Diddy is still dating this guy and their love is just something else. It's beautiful, man. They went swimming and people just envied them. If it was virtually possible to join them in that moment, I knew people who were ready to jump in. Even me, I had my swimsuit ready on the go. I just wanted them to eh, I should, I should come. Should, should I jump in? In this episode, she comes visiting and the kids said, Let's have a scavenger hunt. <laughs> That's like my kid's voice. It's, it sounds manly a little bit. I don't think any child should have that voice. But that's what they said. They said, let's have a scavenger hunt. And guys, that right there is how you know rich kids that have eaten well. Scavenger hunt. Really? I played hide and seek. And I want to bet 70% of the people watching this video right now did not play any single scavenger hunt. And they, they, I'm, I'm not even lying. It's, it's not as if I'm trying to yab you guys. It's just facts. If you did, play scavenger hunt when you were small and you live in Africa because I know the white people, the people that 
And they will do it both now. I, I already clicking. Yeah, I played scavenger hunt when I was in like grade two. Nah, man. If your school wasn't considered as primary, don't comment anything here. Yeah. It's hide and seek we played, man. But you guys are privileged. You guys are privileged, man. <laughs> Send money back. <laughs> we need money. And all I could hear was the countless SGIT fans shouting, This is so cute. Oh my goodness. But at the end of the scavenger hunt, the price was a ring. And I'm like, <laughs> that was cute. That was actually very cute. I do not find anything wrong with it though. But couldn't it just have been money? Think about it. Like, like come on. M marriage is nice, but money, man. <laughs> money. <laughs> Imagine I see money and uh, that. Uh, so I'll be more better than this love you guys are just posting and making everybody jealous. I don't understand. Single people should go and do what should go and, should go and jump into lagoon or what. I don't know. You guys are doing stuff. Why am I always still talking about it? <laughs> and guys, wait, guys, guys, I forgot to say. Did you see the intro where Shalewa kissed me? Did you see it? I, I, I actually don't think you guys saw it. For some reason, can I play it again for the people at the back? The haters at the back that are hiding, eh? Can I play it again? In Tiwa's story, we know she quit her job to help me day. And when she told him she quit, you could see him downplay it like he was not excited. A perfect example of this is when... You know when... I don't even know if you guys understand this, but let me explain. You know when you were small and a girl says she wants to kiss you? <laughs> but you're too shy to move your lips first. Because you think she's joking, and like you don't bring your lips, and she's like, ah, I'm joking, ah, you thought I was going to kiss you, you disgusting piece of. <laughs> so what you do to avoid embarrassment is you you stand there like, I don't I don't know what you're saying, no. <laughs> my lips is shy there, it's just it's there. If if you want to kiss it, go ahead. I'll I'll stop you, me. I, I will not stop you. Just uh, see the lips, do you? Do you want me to draw a map to the lips, please? <laughs> Kiss me, please. <laughs> you guys are desperate. That is the moral of the story. <laughs> a lot happened for them, but the gist is she had some legal issues after resigning and she could not work in TV for a year. So they decided to take the online media by storm and run me out of business, man. How will I compete with a team like that? Then she got pregnant again, and I guess that was just the highlight for them. And you could see them, I don't know, they were happy. This scene should be called kiss, because the amount of times they kissed shocked me. Like, stop, guys. Most of us are single. Stop it. God damn, man. Stop it. Please. Please, man. Shalua had this scene that I would call an eye opener. And in this scene, a woman who was obviously being abused by this rock. I don't know if this man is human anymore because did you see his head? <laughs> what? <laughs> if he nods you, you're done. You're like, you're dead straight. Shalua tried helping her, but the girl was like, it's fine, it's fine. When he's done, he will beg me. I, I know him. I know him. <laughs> That's how she started in my, in my ear. And this right here gave her the energy to take on Kwame. And to Kwame, he was confused because in the last episode, something happened sexually. <laughs> well, you guys saw the video at the intro now, right? Where she kissed me. I, I don't just want to be bringing this up every time, but I think you guys forgot the intro. So I just have to just keep reminding you. You guys saw the I should play it. No, I should not play it. Uh, I won't play it. I won't play it. So it's, uh, you saw it now. But for Shaliwa, this was her final tribute, better still, an act of redemption from being mistreated by Kwame. Then the camera pans to his arms, then his fist. And at this point, everyone started thinking, Oh my goodness, that sci-fi movie that Prince spoke about in the last review, he wasn't wrong, man. This guy is about to destroy her face. She shouted and he started incantating again, but at this time, his spell did not work because deep down, Deep down, Shaliwa knew I loved her. And that's all you need in life. My love. You need my love, guys. When I love you, things just keep happening for you. 
keep things just keep happening. She shouted, Dapada! <laughs> and I was honestly glad Kwame did not like do a free for all and start swinging his hands on my babe. Because I, I don't know, guys, I know I've been going to jail all this while, but this time, death roam. <laughs> Go for it. Go for it. She gets a call from Tito that, that everybody hates at this point. Everybody hates Tito at this point. <laughs> And the news she brought for Shaliwa was that Farida, the chick that did not just seem to leave Mohammed alone, is getting married. But Shaliwa should not be scared because she's not getting married to Mohammed but someone else. And, and I was like, come on, man. Come on. What is with the constant disrespect? I have made close to 30 videos on this show. 30 good videos, no respect at all. They, they don't even mention my name. The other time Shalewa was trending on Twitter, I wasn't trending too. I have feelings too, man. 30 good videos, man. Where's my love? Just. Where's my love? Shaliwa did what I've always wanted her to do to Mohammed, and that is pour him a ton of hot water. Like, pour, pour, pour everything, man. Pour everything on him, man. And both of them looked at each other and smiled. This was Shaliwa using style to tell him that. Did you guys see the intro? Should I play it again? Yes, that is what she was trying to tell him by smiling. Play the intro. Okay, no, I don't play it. Few months passed, nothing majorly happened to these characters. Tiwa's mom took YouTube and now I can't do reviews again because nobody cares about my reviews. <laughs> For Tiwa and Mide, their baby is just around the corner. Oh, oh, no, it's actually coming. And that was how the season ended. With Mide acting awkward. <laughs> It was a wonderful season, a little bit slow at the beginning for me, but at the end, it was worth it. It was totally worth it. My expectation is that there should obviously be another season. And wait guys, hear me out, hear me out, see what I'm trying to say. The, I am not just saying it because I want views. I want views actually. I'm saying because I want views. But there's another reason, there's another reason. But for me, I feel Skinny Girl is just a show that should just be renewed. And if it wanted to end for real, it should have ended in the last season. But now they have given us more stories to look forward to. E.g. motherhood and most importantly, will Prince finally be added to the show, eh, Indani? Mm, eh? What are we saying, Indani? Eh? Think about it. Thank you guys for watching. I'm actually standing. I'm not even sitting down again because my my <laughs> my behind is pitting me from sitting down. You know, I'm kneeling down this time. I just wanted to say a big shout out to everybody that sent in videos. A big shout out to Tito's character. Tito's character. Why did I say Tito's character? <laughs> a big shout out to everybody. The person who played Tito, that her name is Eva. Big shout out to her. She did her best, but she wasn't able to. Post. You guys should not hate her. Hate the character. Don't hate her. No, I don't think anybody hates that person. A big shout out to Abibola Craig for making that video. It was literally the first time we spoke and she made the video for me. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Big shout out to AY for sure. Because I say AY. Why do I call him AY? His name is Heaven. Yes, his name is Heaven. Yes, I'm, I'm sure. Um, a big shout out to him. Wonderful actor. Um, when I reached out to him, he replied me well. A big shout out to everybody, um, all the characters, all the cast, the crew. You guys did a wonderful job, for sure. As I'm kneeling on one hill, on one nail, on one nail, <laughs> on one knee. That's the worst what they call me. Um, a big shout out again to my love, man, Shalewa. <laughs> and that is Shalewa, not Jai. A big shout out to her for making the video. I appreciate, I appreciate. Like her character is the woman that I love <laughs> and, I, and I love the fact that she's also interested Do you understand so thank you to everybody thank you guys for like the constant support on this my videos like I, it was a madness views were just coming left right and center the love on Twitter Instagram and the rest and even though 
I know this is the end <laughs> and views would probably reduce. I know I've left a positive impact in some people's lives in terms of like the videos I make. I don't talk much about like the videos I make and the stress, but guys, see here, I'm drenched in sweat. So I'm recording. <laughs> and this my recording is I've been recording for 29 good minutes. This is probably going to be a 15 minutes long video, I guess, or 60 minutes. I, I might not be right. Um a big shout out to the person that edited the Tiroko Critic. I'm sorry that I called his name last. Like for some reason, I'm sorry. His channel is obviously linked down below in the description. Please show him some love. Tell him I sent you. Like tell him I sent you because he has helped me out post. I say he has helped me out post. He has helped me post all these my videos. And a huge shout out to everybody that listens to this part because like Omo, it's not easy. And everybody that comments, thank you very much. Because I know I follow a lot of YouTubers and I'm a huge fan of a lot of YouTubers. But I don't comment. It's not as if I don't love them, but I just don't comment. So, to everybody that goes there, shout out to comment. Thank you very much. I probably have some content that will be coming in next week. I will just be doing, I don't know what I can do. Maybe q and I don't know. You guys should tell me what you want next. Because like it's time to take a short break. Then hit you with some bangers, man. Some bangers. All right. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching. I love you. I'm not online. I love you guys. Um, and yeah, we'll catch ourselves on the next one. Thank you, Roku. <laughs> Go check his new video out, please. It's wonderful. He got drunk with his wife, and I don't know, it's just crazy. All right, bye, guys. Bye.